Happy Friday! I have some good news. My doorbell just rang like 15 minutes ago and I was new. I was expecting something and so I ran down. I usually ignore everyone. Uh, I ran down and I got it and it's this little box. They say the good things come in small packages, right? Right. Okay. So what do you think we have here? Oh, I don't know. Maybe new Cameo 4 blades. Yay! excited and also I uh, I got something in there if you've got a cameo three if you've got a curio and if you've got a portrait too are you guys ready we're gonna open this together I'm so excited okay here we go I'll show you how now just everybody just before we get too far into this you need to know <laughs> that I literally it, it, this just came off my front doorstep so I'm not putting this in my machine right now and cutting. I actually went through Amazon yesterday and ordered about $100 worth of products uh, to try to test cut all of this stuff from leather to, um, um, le what did I order? I, I ordered all kinds of stuff. I'll tell you more on that and then I got it. We got to get this open. Okay, ready? Okay, I'll pull you down here. All right, here we go. I get a lot of packages. Not a lot that I'm so excited to get or you know maybe been begging for for you know months here we go okay first pen holder pen holder now you guys know I was not a huge fan of the pen holder for the cameo three two and one however the pen holder for the cameo four may be a game changer and I'm going to tell you more about that in a second okay this is a cameo four only tool all right, so it's available for pre-order now. I threw the link up to get all of this stuff up top or to the side, which however way you're watching. This is a Cameo 4 only tool. See down here, it says Cameo 4. Don't order it for if you have a Cameo 3. Cameo 3 users, I've got you covered in a second. And then we have the punch tool, another Cameo 4 tool. This one is going to punch in areas of your design that need, need to be weeded out. It is not going to weed for you. All right, oh, I guess I should turn this around so you don't all see my address and come visit me. I like visitors, but not that much. Okay, then we've got the rotary blade. Yay, another Cameo 4 tool. Okay, I'm gonna take this out of the package and show you what to do with it in a minute. Okay, and then finally, for my Cameo 3 users, my portrait user, my portrait 2 users, and my Curio users, craft blade. Okay, this is the two millimeter craft blade. There is a three millimeter craft blade for the Cameo 4. That one is not in my box, but that's okay. We've got four new tools. Now here's the thing, you'll see that these, this is a two pack. The um, craft blades, both the two millimeter for the older machines, as well as the three millimeter for the Cameo 4, they come as a two pack. You're gonna ask me price. The price, I got all this written down here. The price for the, Three millimeter craft blade is $14.99 for the two pack. All this information I threw links up top so you guys can see. And then the two pack of craft blade, two millimeter craft blades for the Cameo 3, Portrait 2, and Curio. Um, I, those are, oh shoot, I think those are the same price as well, but you're gonna have to give me one second here to find. I, I'm pretty sure it's $14.99 for those as well. But we don't care about that right now, right? We just wanna see how this works. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you um, how to use these, um, or what, I'm not gonna cut anything. I told you guys, I need, I need you need, bleh. software needs to be updated um, to make sure that you have all the settings for these new blades and tools. And so um, I have not done that yet, but I am going to show you how it fits in here and everything like that, okay? All right, so this is my Cameo 3. Let's just take the lid off so it's, out of our way okay yes so the three, three millimeter craft blades um, for the other machine this machine over here the cameo 4 as well as these which is for the cameo um, 3 they're both the same price $14.99 and they come as a two pack okay all right so let's open now I threw the links up there so you can get them. These are all on pre-order. They'll start shipping um, from Swing Design in just a couple weeks, in November, okay? If you're asking me when, why I don't have a, the craft blade for the um, 
Cameo 4, yeah, I'm not sure. But my friends at Silhouette sent me all these, so I'm at least happy about that. Okay, so it has an adjustable, um, it has the adjustable um, at the bottom, and that's how you expose the blade. Okay, can you see this blade is very much exposed, okay, as opposed to a ratchet blade, you can see, can you see the difference? Let me put this up to a 10 so you can see that. You can see the difference. It's basically double. Okay. So this is a one millimeter. This is a two millimeter. And then the three millimeter is not yet available, but that one will be available for the Cameo 4. Okay, so this fits in the Cameo 3 in either carriage. Okay, so you can um, use that in either carriage. Now, what does it cut? Oh, I've got that material for you, that information for you as well. What it's supposed to be able to cut, which again, I haven't been able to test yet because all my testing supplies are on their way. Um, crepe paper, fabric, um, we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it with mat board, balsa wood, chipboard, acetate sheets, um, okay? So that's what you got over here. Now, let's talk about the Cameo 4 tools, the new Cameo 4 tools. Oh geez, don't look over here. That's not supposed to be available for people to see yet. Oh, God. Okay, hopefully I don't get in trouble for that. Okay, so now we've got, this is the rotary blade. The rotary blade will go in the high pressure carriage of the Cameo 4 only, okay? The high pressure carriage is the second carriage, carriage number two. It's not confusing or anything. This is the Cameo 4 and the Carriage 2 and the, um, yeah. Okay, so this one, just like all the tools and adapters for the Cameo 4 has a sensor on the back. That is so that the tool carriage and the software can communicate and it will know which tool is in the carriage, okay? I don't know if you can see, it's got a little rotary blade in there. You see that? Okay, so this one's going to go in here and lock in that way, okay? So that'll go in the second tool carriage, okay? It only can go in there. This is a different type of tool carriage. This one doesn't seem to go up and down like the other one, okay? I haven't used it yet because I just literally just got the tools. All right, then this is the punch tool. Punch tool literally, same shape, everything as the rotary blade, it will also go in the carriage too. Now, I said that the pen holders were a game changer. I also said that I was not a fan and I have always said that I have not been a fan of the original pen holders. And the reason I haven't been a huge fan of the original pen holders is because um, there are other options for using pens. So for example, you've got, I'll show you, for the older machines, gosh, they make it challenging to open. Um, for the older machines, the Cameo 3, 2, 1, Portrait, all those, if you want to use third-party pens and markers, you have other choices, like the Comus Creations um, marker holder, okay? The problem is it doesn't fit in the Cameo 4 with or without an adapter. So you can't use this. So we need, so if we want to use third party um, pens, whether that's a gel pen or um, Cricut infusible ink marker or you know some future special tool that is like a pen, you need this pen adapter. So right now, if you don't have the pen adapter, the only pens you can use in the Cameo 4 are the silhouette shoot the silhouette sketch pens? I dropped it. You need the you need that blue adapter that I just dropped that comes with the machine, and then that way it can fit in here. However, oh my gosh, my desk is a mess. Once you have the pen adapter, and I will tell you that this one is much higher quality than the original one. I'm happy to see that the quality has improved a bit. These seem about the same, but anyway, all right. Um, let's get an infusible ink marker here. Okay, so what you would do is find the adapter that fits on it. I'm not sure if medium might fit, let's see. And hopefully this will work. Take that off, yep. 
and then you just twist in the threaded part and you put that whole contraption into your machine and that's how that works. Now, because you have three different size adapters, you can use different size tools. So if I have, um, you know, this pen that's different thickness, I don't even know if it is or not. I'm trying to see if I've got anything else around, gel pens or whatever. Um, you might need to use the small. No, small won't work. This is the large, okay? It depends on the diameter of your of your marker or pen. I don't have anything else close enough to grab. If you've got a pencil, you know, you can use the small one, which just fell on the floor. So anyway, pen adapters, tool, pen and marker adapters for the Cameo 4 are out. The rotary blade, available for pre-order for the Cameo 4. Punch tool, available for the Cameo 4 um, as a pre-order. And then the two pack, of the craft blade. This is again, this is a two millimeter craft blade. Now, I'm gonna tell you this right now. If you have a Cameo 4, ideally you wanna use the three millimeter craft blade. That's the other, follow me, that's the other orange topped tool. The shape looks like this, but it has an orange top. That's the three millimeter craft blade, and that one specifically is for the high force carriage in the Cameo 4. However, you can also use this two millimeter craft blade, which is intended for the older machines, and you can put it in the craft blade adapter that came with the Cameo 4. Hmm. Hold on. Okay, so that goes like that. And this one goes well, it's supposed to. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Okay. Wow. Okay, well, I got to test a little more. This is the craft blade, I'm telling you right now. And it came with, it came with, oh, there we go. Okay, so that goes like that. And then, like I said, you'd also have the orange topped craft blade for the Cameo 4. So you could potentially put two craft blades in your Cameo 4. But this one can be used with the adapter in the Cameo 4, or it can be used without the adapter in your older Silhouette machines, okay, in either carriage. Don't use this. I would not recommend using this in the Cameo 1 or the Portrait be, um, or the Cameo 2 because it doesn't have as much clearance. This is a 2 millimeter clearance, and so you've got... Um, two millimeter blade to go with it, okay? All right, and now I will clean up my disc and go test and play, okay? All right, all right, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome week. Um, those of you asking me what materials, what can cut, I'm working on it. I literally have a whole spreadsheet here of like what tools can cut um, which thing. Right now, they're all just claims, like, oh, the craft blade can cut this, well, that may be true, but I haven't tried it yet, so I don't know. But once I do, I'm going to tell you, I'm gonna tell you exactly the material that I use, I'm gonna tell you the exact um, cut settings that I use, and yeah, it's gonna take a while to test all that stuff, but uh, we will do that. So if you're looking for blades, if you wanna get blades ahead of time, they are all on pre-order, I threw the links up there. Um, don't forget, if you ordered a Cameo 4 from Swing Design, they sent a coupon code, or they will send once you order 40% off, um, for your blades, there's no coupon for the um, two millimeter craft blade, but for the other blades, you can get 40% off if you ordered a bundle from Swing Design, and that email will come to you. The coupon will come in your email. Um, I'm trying to think of what else I can tell you. I think that's it. Have a good weekend, right? All right, I'll see you guys.